The topic I'll be discussing today is Wave Division Multiplexing, or WDM. To start, optical networking is the method of transmitting a signal that is encoded onto light. Wave Division Multiplexing, or WDM, is a technology that is used in fiber optics which multiplexes signals in order to transmit them via a signal optical fiber. The term multiplexing simply means that multiple signals are combined together into one so that they can be transferred using the same device. Each signal must have different wavelengths of light, otherwise the signals being transmitted will interfere with one another. So why is WDM important for fiber optics communication? There are many benefits to using WDM technology. Most importantly is that they allow for the emission of unnecessary wires or cables when transmitting and receiving data. This is because, as explained before, multiple data signals can be passed down a single optical fiber. Moreover, WDM technology enables for low-cost expansion as an additional cable is not needed. Instead, you would only need to send an additional wavelength of light that isn't being used already down the same fiber. However, despite having several benefits, WDM technology is rather complex and is much more expensive for smaller networks compared to traditional copper wires. Also, it seems rather unnecessary for companies that are currently using copper wires since they would have to place new optical fiber cables and test to see if everything works, which could be very time consuming. 